uncontrolled demand practices over the years has led to the depletion of the ozone layer, increasing the ultraviolet radiation reaching the Earth's surface, giving rise to greenhouse effects and even global warming, which has in no small way affected humans and the planet negatively. This is why we need to take it upon ourselves and work together to invest in and save our planet. How do we do this? We need to improve on our waste disposal and waste management systems. We also have to control the amount of waste we generate as this is paramount to investing in our planet. Furthermore, we need to reduce the use of fossil fuels and invest in renewable and sustainable energy sources as this will help reduce air pollution which is dangerous to both the people and the planet and also reduce green, the emission of greenhouse gases, making energy accessible and preserving our planet. More so, we should go into tree planting, frown at deforestation and invest in local farmers and food systems. Additionally, we need to pay attention to and embrace the arrows of waste management, some of which are reduce, reuse and recycle. Most especially, we should pay close attention to and engage in recycling, which is the process of generating reusable materials from waste that usually will be thrown away. In conclusion, echo education and sensitization of people on why they should not get involved in practices that poses danger to the planet is very crucial. Investing in our planet is not a one-sided responsibility. Instead, it is our collective responsibility. Therefore, let us come together and join hands to invest in and save our planet, to create a sustainable environment for all. Together, we can. Thank you.